We told, told you we were bringing in a psychic media to just get us prepared for 2022. We always love talking to Michelle Wells. She is an author, um, psychic medium, owner of Soultopia. So Michelle, as I understand it, people are, I mean, the readings have increased, what, 150% over this kind of pandemic time? Yes, they have. It's been uh, great. People have really wanted to not only get readings, but learn how to read and read for themselves. Oh, really? Do you think we all have the ability to sort of read what's happening in our lives? Are there signs that we miss and you're just more tuned into them? I do. I think everyone can learn to read the signs and, and read what's going on around them. And some of us just are oblivious to it. And, and if we can just start paying attention, attention to it, all of us can read. Yes. Oh, oh. interesting. Okay. Well, Michelle, so since you haven't taught Ron and I to read ourselves or each other yet, um, can, can you read us in front of everybody? Are you getting a vibe <laughs> through the air? Like, <clears throat> what does it take for you? Are you? Is it just hearing our voice? Do we have to be in your presence or is, is this good enough? No, you don't have to be in my presence. I can read remotely for people and I can just set an intention that I am going to read. I just ask that I read for your highest and best good and then I can give you a reading. So who wants to go first? Uh, Jenny, you go first. Okay, I'm ready. Okay, so I, I'm, I'm gonna pull a couple cards and, and then I will go from there. Okay, so Jenny, what I'm getting for you is that, and I'm gonna do kind of 2022. Okay, okay. Yes, perfect. Yes, uh, yes. So, okay, so let's just do, do We don't that. care what happens the rest and, of this Yeah, week. this is a lost cause 2021. <laughs> <laughs> let's, let's just move on, right? Yeah. Okay, so 2022, I'm getting uh, that it is a time for you to step into the fullness, I mean, look how, look at you, you're so successful already, but it's, it's time to step into the fullness of everything that you want to do the, uh, in, in every area of your life, confidence in every single area, and to really make sure that, and, but you're going to have to do that in some of the confines of some, some conformity of certain things sure. that you have to work within. And so you're gonna to have to navigate that. Also some certain moral things that you have to work through and how you want to navigate those things. So it's also a hierarchy with, that you have to work within of, of what you want to do within your life, but also navigating what that means for you morally and your moral compass. Interesting. Okay. Interesting. Well, I don't know what she's talking about, but is it ringing familiar? I think this could be very true. <clears throat> yes. Okay. That's right. interesting. Okay. Thank you, Michelle. Wow. Okay. Well, we'll have to sound like on she's that. saying you're not working hard enough, I don't, but that's just no, my interpretation. No, I think she's saying I need to <laughs> lean into it. I'm going to become, you know, just even more me. <laughs> do more. Do more. All right, Michelle. Okay. What do you have so for a wrong? lot of these questions are born out of, I know these readings are probably born out of this, this notion of uncertainty that has come with the pandemic, people's employment, not knowing when life will quote unquote go back to normal. Um, and, and so is uncertainty kind of the theme that's emerged with your readings and what people are looking for? Absolutely. It's, it's all around uncertainty. And it's, it's they're the same questions. It's love, it's work, uh -huh. it's health. I mean, it, it's the same underlying questions that you always get, but now it's, Amplified. The thing that's mm -hmm. over it is what's going to happen in the world. And so it's got this new layer on top of it. But All right. So am I giving you any vibes? What am I giving you for vibes today? <clears throat> you, yeah, you are. Um, and so I did pull some cards and you, you know, you got two aces out of 78 cards. And so that's mm -hmm. good. Ron. I mean, so that what that means is, I mean, yeah, it means <laughs> the aces are always good. And, but they, they're, they're new beginnings, but new beginnings, sometimes people freak out about the new beginnings. They're like, what do you mean new beginnings? I like what I'm doing. New beginnings are saying, you're even gonna take it to the next level. So both of you, it's not that you're not doing enough. It's like, okay, you're ready to step it up. And also I'm gonna tell you one more thing, Ron. Mm -hmm. um, it's living in the moment. It's making sure that you're living and enjoying the moment. And then I see that your health there's an area of your health that's actually gonna get better. And there's a purchase that you wanna make that I'm seeing that you should go ahead and make. Interesting. Oh. All right, that rings familiar. Wow. That that hits home. He has been wanting to buy me a new car. Yeah, so of Michelle, course I have. Thank you of course I have. for that. We're thank like, you, we're sorry. all like Oprah up in here. Um, <laughs> you get a car and you get a car. Michelle, thank you so much.
Congratulations on your success with Soultopia, your book, yeah. everything that's happening, Soul What, your podcast. You can check out Michelle at michellewelch.com. You can also get a reading as well. She has a special for Morning After viewers. If you use the code MA for Morning After 2022, you'll receive 10% off any order oh. online or in person. And we, <clears throat> this is the second time we've had a reading. The first one was behind the scenes ahead of her visit, and this one was live on the air. That could be such a cool last minute gift to give to somebody if they're interested I in that so. sort of thing, to get them a reading. That would be, you know, and, and, and I know there's different viewpoints on that, but this is something that's so fun and interesting, um, I think, to look at and dabble with, you know, just, just learning from different people and their thoughts. And look, the predictions came true. And it may just give you something to think about, right? Totally. Applicable regardless of whether you believe it or not or believe in the process that you can maybe get a little guidance or advice. So yeah, I think it's a great gift as well.